Hey everybody, Dustin Briley here with Briley Brothers. Today we're in Waddell, Arizona, and we're gonna take a look at this four bedroom, three and a half bathroom single family home that sits on 1.22 acres with a detached guest house plus an additional garage. Wait till you see this house. Let's get to it. So this house is 3,701 square feet. The guest house is 2,078 square feet. It was originally built in 2005. It's gonna be a total of five oversized garage spaces. Three on the main house, two on the back, plus RV parking. So you got the RV gate right there three-car garage on the main house right here. If you're not familiar with Waddell, it's right next to Surprise, Arizona. It's gonna be about 30, 35 minutes from the Phoenix Airport. And this house sits about three to five minutes away from the 303, which gives you straight access into Phoenix. So this is a really nice location. As you enter the home, you're going to notice that it's a combination between tile and carpet throughout the home. Over here, you have the dining room, which connects over to the kitchen and the pantry. Here you have the, I would describe this as the formal living room. It also includes a nice wet bar, very pretty cabinets. Nice tall ceilings in this house. Here we have bedroom number one. The walk in closet. has its own full bath. Bedroom number two. That bedroom, bedroom number two, is gonna have access to this bathroom right here. The bathtub shower combination. Here we have bedroom number three. This bedroom's gonna share the last bathroom that we went through. And then French doors leading into the primary bedroom with views of the backyard, crown molding, nice oversized primary bedroom with plenty of room to have a seating area, TV, maybe even a home office. Shower is wonderful. Nice large shower with a built-in step or seat inside there, and then the beautiful jetted giant bathtub. So great setup. And then the same cabinets that match the bar that we saw. Walk-in closet. All right, so passing by the formal living room, the dining room. Over here we have the half bath and another maybe area that might put your keys, just some additional storage. Now we open up into the kitchen and family room. Great spot right here for a table. You do have a fireplace, plenty of fans, granite countertops. Once again, we carry the same 
kitchen cabinets into the kitchen, stainless steel double ovens plus the microwave, crown molding on top of the cabinets, which I really like. More storage. This house definitely does not lack storage. And then we have the pantry right here. You can shut these French doors for a little more privacy. Now we flow into the family room. Many different options, plenty of wall space to put your TV and decide how you want to live in this room. French doors leading to the back. Through here, that is a exit to the side yard of the property. Here we have the oversized laundry room with once again, I think there's a theme here, more cabinets plus the sink and an additional fridge. And then this bonus space over here that could easily be converted into an additional bedroom if you needed so, or an office, kind of a lot of uses for that space, especially since it has that outside exit right there. Back in the kitchen, this is gonna be your entry into the three car garage, the oversized, very large three car garage. All right, well, let's pop out back. I'll show you the backyard as well as the guest house and the additional garage spaces. Right outside, we have the large and extended covered patio. Plenty of space here to entertain. Got this giant outside bar with barbecue pit as well as fireplace. This is really a great space for entertaining. This house has it all when you consider that it has grass plus 1.22 acres, so plenty of space to park equipment or kind of whatever uh, you choose to do with this large of a lot. Here you have a shed. Oh, I just saw a rabbit. You can see the guest house has plenty of space for whatever your heart could imagine. A full bathroom. And then over here, currently they have it set up with a ice machine, sink, and a water heater, but this space is AC, so this could be uh, the bedroom. You'd need to add a closet could add a couple bedrooms in here. Really whatever you need, you have the space for. So this is all a seat inside here and this is part of the guest house. And then through these doors, we have the garage space.
right, well, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you have any questions, our contact information will be down in the description. And if you need help buying or selling, we're in the top 1% of realtors, which means we have the opportunity to help a ton of people buy and sell. So we would love to help you. Or if you just simply need someone to manage your property, we also do property management and we'd love to help you out. Okay, have a great day and I'll see you on the next video.